Hello, gents. Today, we are going to explore the most underutilized appliance in the entire home, the toaster. Yeah, you can toast bread in there or bagels or whatever, but did you know there's a lot of other stuff that you should be toasting in there? You will now. Today, I'm going to go through all kinds of cool crap and let you know about what you ought to be toasting. Let's start off with a macadamia nut cookie and an oatmeal cream pie. Okay, the smoke has started pouring, so I'm going to end this one. Oh boy, yeah, everything kind of collapsed. Well, this is a mixture of oatmeal cream pie and macadamia nut cookie. Um, wow, that is really good. Tastes like it just came out of the oven. Let's get healthy for just a minute. Let's do some vegetables. I got a carrot and a jalapeno. Okay, that is one hot jalapeno. That is one hot carrot. Whew. I dare say I like toasted carrot better than regular raw carrot. Give the jalapeno a try. It's hot because it's toasted, but it's absolutely zero spice. So strange. Okay, next I'm going to try a hot dog and a sausage patty. Okay, after two toastings, the hot dog's looking good. The sausage needs another go. We'll try out this hot dog while the sausage is going on toasting number three. Well, I mean, this is as good as this cheap hot dog is going to get. This is one of them crappy... <coughs> Crappy cheap hot dogs that I hate and my kids love. But after twice through the toaster, that's pretty good. All right. That's looking good. I ended up toasting that sucker four times. Cooked clear through. Oh, that's good. Toasted sausage, thumbs up. Next up, I have a donut glazed that I've sliced in half. Yeah. Don't think I've ever had a toasted donut before. But this won't be my last one, I'll tell you that right now. How about a fruity little shish kebab? Hot pineapple is good. Hot watermelon is bad. The honeydew and the cantaloupe were bad to begin with I think so nah you knew I was going to do bacon right okay it shows promise after one go but it's going to need at least one more all right that's looking pretty good yeah that's very good I've never had toasted bacon. I really liked it. Okay, this is really bad corn. Horrible. Uh, I don't know if anything can make this corn good. But I'm going to try it anyway. I sliced the cob in half, got some butter and some salt on there. Let's see what happens. Huh. 
You know, I think I'm onto something. I can tell that this would be really good if this was good corn. Um, yeah. Started with very horrible corn on the cob. I'm definitely going to do this again with good corn on the cob. I think it's going to be great. It's not that bad. This is the one I'm most excited to try. Got a flat iron steak. Let's see how it goes. Wow, that looks good and that smells good. If you like your steak rare, I think I've just created something. Holy crap. Toaster steak is awesome. And that is good. You saw it here first. The toaster steak has been born. Mmm. Three toasts. Toasted to perfection. Mmm. Can I just make a prediction right now? Toaster steaks are going to become a thing. Let's give pickles a try. It tastes like pickle. Go figure. But it's toasty. All right. Jumbo squid, octopus style in soy and vegetable oil. Yeah. Well, as unappetizing as that is, I dare venture to guess it's going to be better than it would have been eating it cold right out of that can. Hey, not bad. Thank you, toaster. Well, at this point, I think the only thing left is to attempt to toast an egg. All right, that was an epic fail. Got a little calamari in there. So anyway, uh, hope you learned something today. How about this? Don't not do stuff just because other people don't not do it. Try stuff that you haven't tried before. It might be good. Just because people aren't doing something doesn't mean that it can't be good. Half the crap that I toasted was really good. Um... A lot of it, not so much. Anyways, try some stuff out. See you soon, gents. Oh, we're still rolling?